If you've been around my channel long enough, you know that my typical style of content is tech slash setup videos. But you would also know that I always mention wanting to make more vlogs. So today I'm going to start documenting my life. I've always enjoyed this vlog style content, but it hasn't done very well on my channel, especially compared to my setup videos. But I have realized that vlogging or documenting my life is for more than just the content. It allows me to look back at where I once was, but also reflect on where I'm currently at instead of always looking at the future. Okay, so as you had already seen, uh, I did the video for the apartment, just like a little real estate type video. Now, like I said before, this is a way to document my life and reflect on where I'm at currently and really enjoy life and taking the moment. But with that being said, I'm not one of those content creators that try to make my life look extravagant or like I constantly have fun days. Today is a day that I'm off work, but technically I'm not because I'm a part-time basketball coach. And so today I do have a meeting at the school for the coaching staff. And I'm also going to get up there a little bit earlier because the varsity team has practice, which is not the team that I coach. I coach middle school, um, but the varsity team has an open gym today. So I'm going up there. They like when I come around and help them. So I'm going to go up there and help them before the meeting. This is going to end up taking about four or five hours of my day. Um, to get to the open gym plus the meeting afterwards. Also, I have been at this computer desk for a little bit of time editing, um, working on this video plus the apartment video that I just did. So even though I don't have much video of that, that is another part of my day, of course, is editing and we'll have to do that later tonight as well. So if you couldn't already tell, I don't have my wide angle lens with me right now. That's why I'm at such a terrible angle for this video. I'm actually having to get my wide angle lens repaired. Uh, so I should receive it actually tomorrow from this video. So for my next video, I should have it back and everything. Um, and I may end up doing a video on that is the 17 to 70 millimeter 2.8. Uh, I just finished up the practice or the open gym that I was telling y'all about. We have about 20, 25 minutes till the meeting starts. Um, so while I'm hanging out, I figured I'd go ahead and talk about one more thing. I really wanna hit on the content that's coming. I know that I said I'm gonna document my life. I don't also wanna just post like day in the life, day in the life, day in the life. Of course, each day in the life that I plan to post will have a purpose. I wanna make these videos kind of motivating. Like I want you to watch them and feel like it gives you a reason to, to be more productive and things like that. That's my main goal. It makes me more productive when I have a camera on me and know that I have to to be productive for the video and that's not because like I said before I'm not faking it for the content at the same time if I was to do a day in the life and I wanted to have one of them lazy days which is fine occasionally but if I wanted to have one of those lazy days I can't record a video I can't have content of a lazy day even if I did I still got to get something done and sometimes I'll have those lazy days and literally get nothing done and that's not okay and so I think having the content on me or the camera on me at least somewhat often will allow me to be more motivated more productive again as I was saying all of my content I plan for it to have some sort of value to the person watching for example today is just one the beginning so it's just kind of the intro to this new style of content and of course let me make it clear tech content will still be a thing on my channel I know y'all enjoy seeing my setup and I'm not pushing that away completely um, I just want to have something new and fresh so that my channel is not the same style content over and over again I enjoy making tech content and I like tech in general I always like adding on to my setup and the things that I have been doing recently but of course I get kind of busy and I also don't like the idea that my content is so similar this will allow me to have somewhat of a new fresh look each time I upload a video but anyways like I was saying today's video is kind of the intro I'm um, also motivating you to document your life that is really the purpose like I hope that when you watch this video you can take some inspiration and actually start your vlog and by the way you don't need nice camera equipment uh, you don't need camera equipment at all really get a phone maybe a tripod might be helpful with the phone um, but the phone has a great camera I am personally using a Sony ZV-E10 that is a very good budget vlogging camera um, a tripod and a phone can at least get you started
All right, so it is currently 1048. I think you can see that. First off, no, the meeting did not last this long. Um, the reason that I'm just now picking up the camera, I ended up going and playing basketball right after the meeting. So I played pickup basketball for a couple hours. I didn't originally plan on being out this long. Um, typically, I do a lot more at night. Uh, I have a little night routine. Um, where I like to get a lot of editing and stuff like that, schoolwork and all that done. With the driving that I've done today and the basketball that I've played, it's a good time to call it a night. But real quick, I do want to talk about the things that I was talking about earlier in this vlog. Hopefully this vlog ended up being kind of short. I'm not 100% sure, but I tried to keep it short. That's why there's not a lot of footage going on. Um, like I said before, I'm planning to keep this style content very valuable and just hit on specific points. But today was just to motivate you to start creating and start documenting your life. So with that being said, I, I didn't really hit on everything that I wanted to say earlier on in this video, so I do want to hit on it now. As I said before, vlogging has been very positive for me. And I may be alone on this, but it has genuinely improved my life. First off, as I said before, it has actually held me accountable and being productive throughout my day. Now again, that could come off the wrong way and make it sound like I can't relax or anything throughout my day because I'm doing the videos and the documenting and all that. Let me just be clear and say that sometimes I'm just overly relaxed and I don't truly take advantage of each minute that I have during the day. Trust me, I understand sometimes you want those days just to sit back, relax, and enjoy yourself. Um, and there's still nothing wrong with that. That can still be productive because sometimes we have to rest our body and rest our mind. But um, if you're just laying around being lazy, you're not taking advantage of the time that you have. And to add on to that, since I really started this, I've been going outside more and just enjoying life in general. And I made sure that I don't live the life where it's just work, eat, sleep. Because I know, unfortunately, a lot of people do live that lifestyle. Um, and for some people, that's their only choice. But for me, I know I have the opportunity to do greater things. So this has allowed me and motivated me to step out and make my life more enjoyable. And kind of on the same note as what I said, but secondly, it has made me appreciate life a lot more. It helped me live in the moment, you know, really take in everything and grasp everything that I'm doing at that moment. While it also gives me the opportunity to reflect at the end of the day or at whatever point that I'm looking over my camera, my footage, it just allows me to reflect and really see um, the enjoyable and productive day that I had. You'd be surprised at how cool some days truly are, but we just don't think about it when we don't see it again by the end of the day. Especially once you sleep and everything, you kind of just forget about everything that you did the day before. Lastly, it actually taught me some very valuable skills. I don't feel like this one has to be explained very much, but learning how to vlog and building a brand around yourself is very valuable. Not only will it help with like your tech knowledge and your videography skills, but it'll also teach you business related skills like marketing and communication, especially when you start working with other businesses and other companies. I never really thought I'd get to this point, but I've actually gotten to the points where this videography and this channel and everything actually become very valuable on my resume. Like I said, it shows my marketing skill set and just the small entrepreneur skills with building my own brand, with communicating with businesses and those things. It actually has become very helpful on my resume. So again, make my point clear there's a lot of other values to starting a channel documenting your life picking up a camera there's so much more valuable things than just doing it for fun anyways i hope y'all did enjoy this video if you did make sure to drop a like and subscribe expect more of this type of content so i hope you did enjoy it if you did make sure to comment down below if you don't already know i'm very appreciative of all like the comments and all the supporters i have though this isn't a full-time job y'all don't understand how motivating the success on this channel truly is to me i see a lot of people that comment over and over again that truly does motivate me and it means the world to me um, because as a young kid I never thought that I'd be able to make YouTube videos um, and do it as kind of like a part-time job. I'm very appreciative. I love each and every one of y'all. I try to respond to every comment and I'm going to continue to set that goal in mind. And just because I want to give you more of a reason to comment, if I don't reply to your comment within 48 hours, I have to subscribe to every single person that comments. So just for fun, comment down below. Let's see how quickly I can respond to all my comments. Again, I hope that you enjoyed. If you did, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Peace.